Lights, camera, action! Dr. Potts, My Pets Have Spots Written by Rod Hull and illustrated by Miriam Latimer Mr. Betts, who had lots of pets, went in a panic one day to the vets. The vet, whose name was Dr. Potts, listened and said, You've got lots and lots of pets. What's wrong with them, Mr. Betts? Poor Bet sighed. Oh, Dr. Potts, my pets have all got lots of spots. A spotty fish, a spotty cat, a spotty snake, a spotty rat, a spotty rabbit, a spotty frog, a spotty canary, and a spotty dog. Dear me, dear me, said Dr. Potts, and searched through her book till she came to spots. Now strawberries suffer from brachuritis. It seems your pets have spotty titus. Spotty titus? Is that bad? Poor Mr. Betts was feeling sad. Nothing bad that I can't cure, though Dr. Potts was not quite sure. She thought of pills or perhaps a lotion, but decided on a special potion. She mixed it up behind a screen and returned with a medicine that was bright green. Give them this three times a day. That should take the spots away. So Mr. Betts, feeling quite assured, was convinced his pets would soon be cured. He followed the instructions to the letter and wished and hoped his pets would get better. The spots went away, which was a surprise, but Mr. Betts couldn't believe his eyes. He looked at his pets and shouted, Yikes! No more spots. They were covered in stripes. Off at once back to the vets ran an angry Mr. Betts. Stripes, said a startled Dr. Potts. You mean they've got stripes instead of spots? That's what I said, said Mr. Betts. Now I'm the owner of stripey pets. A stripey fish, a stripey cat, a stripey snake, a stripey rat, a stripey rabbit, a stripey frog, a stripey canary, a stripey dog. It was obvious something had gone wrong. Perhaps the green stuff was much too strong. Aha, said the vet, I know what to do. Green's no good. Give them this. It's blue. With the blue medicine, Mr. Betts went away. But you'll never guess what. He was back the next day. Hello, Dr. Potts said. Did that do the trick? Tell me your pets are no longer sick. Well, began Betts as he faced Dr. Potts. The green stuff you gave me got rid of the spots, but gave them a bad case of stripes instead. So I gave them the blue stuff, just like you said. The stripes went away, but it's worse than I feared. Now each of my pets has grown a beard. A bearded fish, a bearded cat, a bearded snake, a bearded rat, a bearded rabbit, a bearded frog, a bearded canary, and a bearded dog. Aha, that's easy to cure, my good fellow. Give them this twice a day, it's yellow. So once again, Mr. Betts went away. And once again, he was back the next day. The green stuff you gave me, he said. Dr. Potts was quite successful. It got rid of the spots, but gave them a bad case of stripes instead. So I gave them the blue stuff, just as you said. Then as you saw, the stripes disappeared, but left all my pets with very long beards. So I gave them the yellow stuff, and by and by, the beards went away, but they started to cry. A crying fish, a crying cat, a sobbing snake, a sobbing rat, a weeping rabbit, a weeping frog, a wailing canary, and a wailing dog. Goodness me, Dr. Potts was worried. Again behind the screen she hurried. There she thought and scratched her head and chose a medicine that was bright red. Poor Mr. Betts, he gave a sigh. <sighs> Anything was worth a try. Taking the medicine, he ran from the vets, but back the next day came Mr. Betts. Dr. Potts was getting vexed and wondering what would happen next. 
Mr. Betts looked a sorry sight, as if he had been up all night. Did it work, Mr. Betts? The vet inquired. Did it give you the results that you desired? Well, the green stuff you gave me, Dr. Potts, worked to treat no more spots. But as you know, they got stripes instead, so I gave them the blue stuff, like you said. No more stripes, but rather weird. All my pets grew a very long beard. So I gave them the yellow stuff to try, and all my pets began to cry. Next was the red stuff, and no surprise, they stopped crying at once. But they've shrunk in size. A very small fish, a very small cat, a little snake, a little rat, a minute rabbit, a minute frog, a tiny canary, and a tiny dog. Then we've won, Mr. Betts. Oh, how splendid. We'll start from scratch. Your troubles have ended. Your pets are precious. I know you need them. Now all you have to do is feed them. A whole week passed, and then at last, hurrying, scurrying into the vets, came a delightful Mr. Betts. Gone were the spots, the stripes, and the beards. Gone were the weeping and wailing and tears. Grinning and beaming, Mr. Betts was proud to show off his healthy pets. Happy now, he rides the streets and tells each passerby that he meets. I've got a healthy fish, a healthy cat, a healthy snake, a healthy rat, a healthy rabbit, a healthy frog, a healthy canary, and a healthy dog. The end.